Hey guys, what's up? Mike here. Thanks for tuning in to another video. Hope everybody had a great Labor Day weekend. Let's talk PC and Mac. Which one should you get? Now, we're not, we're not going to be going over the details. I'm not some Apple fanboy, nerd, techie. I don't even, I don't know anything about technology in that aspect, nor do I care. All I know is what works for me and what I see that works for everybody else. Okay, now I was just going over this topic. Somebody was asking me about my, my opinion on do they have to switch to a Mac? Can they be successful in this industry on UI, UX design, you know, product design, um, remaining on a PC? And obviously the answer is yes, right? Um, I mean, you don't have to switch to a Mac. You don't have to, you can still be successful on a PC, right? It's like asking me, my job is 15 miles from my house, you know, um, could I walk to work? Obviously the answer is yes, you could walk to work, right? And there's benefits to that, right? Um, you can, uh, smell the fresh air, get some exercise, cardiovascular, you know, you'll live longer, right? It's good for your health, etc. Save the environment, all that stuff. But we all know the, the real answer, right? It's, it's more convenient to get in a car and go to work. Why? Because you can get there in a split second, right? Um, if there's no traffic. But the point here, it's more convenient to drive around to places, okay? Time is money. And so that's the big reason. Time, efficiency, uh, um, on a Mac, right? The tools that are available to you that I'll talk about in a second. And that's just where the industry is, right? At work, everybody's on a PC or on a, on a Mac. Now in the design industry, everybody's on a, a, a Mac. Every, every company you go to, they're on a Mac and it just makes you collaborating with them much more efficiently, right? Through airdrop and just through other things, right? But not only that, and through all the tools, that's available primarily for Mac. But not only that, man, the Mac just works. I was just um, dealing with my son's computer. He has a top of the line Alienware, okay? Now I'm not techie and all that stuff, but I know uh, we got to the point, He all he knew he wanted to play these games that he saw on YouTube, right? This is like a couple years ago. And I bought him a little cheap laptop. The games didn't work. I'm like, why aren't the game, I'm, I'm, I'm emailing everybody, why aren't the games working on this laptop? They're all glitchy. Everyone's like, ah, you need a gaming PC, dude, you know? And I'm like, what's that? And so they sh they sent me to this whole new gaming PC world. I was like, what? I got to spend 1500 bucks to get them, you know? And I spent a, a good penny, got them a nice Alienware um, from Dale, uh, was shipped here, and my son loves it. He gets to play all the games at high speed, high graphics, whatever. It's a gaming PC, it's high power, right? I still use that thing and it's still clunky to me okay compared to a mac not too long ago i had to reinstall his alienware from like the default factory thing because him and his friend downloaded some tried to do some roblox hack or whatever and it's like it just it got some sort of it got buggy and i had to do that you don't get that on not that not not that i even care about bugs and stuff it just everything just works better on a Mac, okay? I don't know what it is. I don't know why Microsoft hasn't caught up in that aspect. I don't know. And I'm being super, super honest. Everything just works better on a Mac. The be only things I like on Windows is Outlook and Word and Excel, whatever, right? Those are the top line. They, they, they kill everybody else when it comes to their email client, you know, Microsoft Outlook and Word and whatever. They, everyone's copying them. But outside of that, just get everything working, moving, opening your computer and having it start for you like instantly, get a Mac, right? Not only that, I, I now work primarily on Sketch, okay? Going forward, I'm just going to be talking about the powers of Sketch and, and, and how to become more of an efficient UI, UX designer using this tool in Sketch and Envision. Uh, and things like that. I use this tool 99% of the time. Now, there are uh, you can do the same exact things in Photoshop. You can do the same exact things in Adobe XD. Guess what? I don't use those tools. So I'm not gonna speak on them. So if I know I use a Mac and this is, these are the tools I use, I'm only going to recommend those tools to my audience because that's what I use. This is what I, I do. Um, you can do whatever you want. You can get whatever tool you want. You can use whatever system you want. Doesn't matter. You is not going. But in my opinion, to be efficient, to be get access to all these Mac only tools, Sketch, um, 
Heck, I, I uh, edit and record all my videos on ScreenFlow. ScreenFlow is available to sketch, right? Uh, it's three times cheaper than Camtasia Studio, which is available for uh, PC. Um, uh, I code with an awesome tool called Coda, right? Which is available for, for it's Mac only. Um, and just the abundance of other things that are just available for Mac. And just, you're just, it's, it's this world that I can't explain that once you're on it, um, not only is it useful, it makes your life easier, you're just now, you can collaborate with folks a lot much more easier and you don't have to worry about, oh man, I'm on a PC, I don't do that. I wish this tool was for PC. I wish this tool was for PC, I did that. Get yourself a Mac, man. It'll be that much more better for you, make your life easier, efficient, and um, have access to this whole new world of, or this whole world of, of, of resources that's available to you. Uh, from the design community. Um, one last story. It, I, like I said, I don't like change. Um, and I can recall when the iPhone started to become much more popular after the first release, I've always held onto my Blackberry. And I was like, dude, I don't care. It's a phone. I actually like the, 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 the QWERTY keyboard, right? This is much more better than the iPhone. You know, I'm like, heck. Kim Kardashian's using it. She's using a BlackBerry. I don't have to switch over. I was holding on to my BlackBerry so long. And get this, the day I switched to Mac, or to the iPhone, I'm sorry. I was like, wow. I'm like, I'm sorry, BlackBerry. Like, you guys are gonna go out of business. I, I, this, is just, this is just so easy to use. And I can see why everybody was telling me for the last three years to go get on the iPhone. And that's what all I'm saying. Get on a Mac. Try somebody. I mean, it'll probably take you a week to switch over from PC to Mac in terms of like all the shortcuts and things like that. But once you're over, you're going to be like, I should have done this a lot sooner. Anyway, that's my thoughts. Hit me up in the comments below. If you have any questions, hit up my, my website, mlwebco.com, and use the contact link on my site. I'll be happy to answer any questions for you. Thanks, guys, for watching. We'll talk soon. Peace.